Georgetown was hit hard by injuries to key players last season and struggled to a record of 5-5, five and five, missing the Class 3A state playoffs. It was a very humbling experience for me, our coaches, and our team. You know, we're going through a four-game stretch there with nine starters out, but we learned from that. On offense, Jarvis Brown provides experience as a dual-threat quarterback who threw for nearly 1,000 yards last season. Good news for Brown is that all his wide receivers are back. And tailback Michael Billings returns after missing five games last year with a severe ankle sprain. Billings is a power back and the centerpiece of the Bulldogs offense. I'm elusive. I like to miss people, make people miss, but also I can be a power running back because I'm kind of big for my size for running back. On defense, most of the down linemen return, along with star linebacker Gerald German. Marquez Drayton is also a key player going both ways at strong safety and wide receiver. Uh, last year was a big upset for us not going to the playoffs after that Myrtle Beach game, but this year you should look forward to watching us play because it's, it's going to be a big surprise. Here's head coach Bradley Adams' take on this year's Georgetown Bulldogs. It's a dog fight every week regardless of who you're playing uh, from within. So how we match up, it's got a lot to do with injuries. Uh, it's got a lot to do with with you know game plans and, and where you stand at the end.